with attacking moves, and we are going to use two moves. The first one's going to be a double scissor. So if you go back to the previous video where we did the scissor move, we're going to do a double scissor today, and then we're also going to do an attacking step over move. So the first one we're going to start with is going to be the double scissor. So all we're going to need is our ball and just a little bit of space. So what we're going to do right now, and just like we did with the single scissor where we swing our leg from behind the ball or around the front and land on the side and touch, what we're going to do today is do two scissor moves. So we're going to go one, we're going to go two, and then we're going to touch into space around the defender. Okay? So again, we want to start a little bit behind the ball, and the foot and a double scissor, the first foot I swing with is going to be the foot I end up taking that touch with to beat the defender. Okay? So what we're going to do right now is just go nice and slow, and we're going to get comfortable swinging around the ball. Swing. And notice how every time we swing and plant our foot, we want to be light on our toes, have a little spring in the knees to be able to push out and explode with that touch that's going to beat the defender. And again, these swinging movements are to get the defender to step and fall for those little fakes, allowing us a small window or maybe a big window to touch and explode to get past them. So on your own right now, what I want you to do is just get comfortable swinging around the ball. So one, two, touch. And we'll go again. Okay? So we're going to go one, two, and touch. Okay? So on your own, just practice swinging around the ball. One, two, touch. One, two, touch. And as you do more, and as you become more comfortable with those movements, with the scissor, maybe you go a little bit faster each time. Okay, so as we get more comfortable, one, two, and touch. Okay, so on your own right now, take a few minutes and just get comfortable swinging once, twice, and touching the space. One, two, and touch. Okay? So take a minute, two minutes, three minutes, as, many, as much time as you need to get comfortable doing this double scissor. Take that time now, and then come back and resume the video. So we're going to move on now, and we're going to continue with our double scissor, but this time we're going to dribble forward and do it while we're moving the ball, okay? So we're gonna keep, just like we've done in, in previous activities and moves, we wanna keep the ball close to our feet and be able to swing two times while the ball is moving. So we'll go again. Okay, we can take one or two touches, three or four, as long as they're short, sharp. And we're gonna get comfortable swinging around the ball as it's moving forward. Okay, so little touches, we're going to go swing, swing, and touch. Okay? And if you have a cone or a water bottle or something that you can put in front of you to act as a defender, why don't you put that in place if you have it? If not, no worries. So now I'm going to dribble towards this defender, and what I'm going to do is touch just one, two, and touch around that defender. So as I swing first with my right, swing with the left, touch with the right. Okay? So if I started on my left, one, two, I take with the left. Okay? So again, take a few minutes, get comfortable dribbling forward, get comfortable keeping that ball nice and close, and again, go in slow motion if you have to, and as you get comfortable with the double scissor, try to go a little bit faster, a little bit more game like Okay, so that is the double scissors. So now we're going to move on 
and we're going to step over attacking move. So in our previous video, we touched on doing a step over to change direction and turn. But this time, we're going to do our step over to beat a defender. Okay, so what we're going to do is almost just walk over the ball, do our step over move, and the same foot I stepped over with, it's going to be the same foot I take my touch with. Okay? So again, I'm going to step over and get the defender to fall for that fake and that step, touch or pass the defender. Okay, so get that ball nice, still in front of you, and just get comfortable stepping over and taking. Again, you're using the outside of your foot to take that touch. So step over and take. Okay? So again, we're going to start slow as many times as we need. Step over and take. And reset. And step over and take. Okay? So again, watch this as many times as you need. Watch how we Break down the move, stepping over the ball, the part of the foot I use to take the touch. And go on and practice on your own as many times as you need. And then come back and resume the video. So now, just like we did in the previous move, we're going to now take touches in the forward direction to do this move. So now we're going to dribble towards the defender. So again, I'm going to get my defender up. This is going to be my marker to let me know when I need to perform that move. Okay? So I don't have a whole lot of space here, so I want to make sure my touches are, are very close to my feet, not getting too far away from me so the defender can steal it, um, and giving me an idea of when I want to start this move. So again, keeping the ball close, step over, and touch. Okay. Back up, create a little bit of space to go forward, and step over, and touch. So we want to get comfortable part of the foot we're using to dribble, so it should be with the outside of our foot, the pinky toe, keeping that toe pointed down, making the top, the laces part of your, your shoe nice and big, okay? Keep it close, I'm gonna step over, and I'm gonna touch, okay? And get comfortable on your right, and doing it on your left, step over, and touch. Okay, so start slow, and again, as you get more comfortable doing this move, make it a little bit more explosive and a little bit quicker as we get better at doing it. Okay? One more time. Step over and touch. And we'll do one, right? This time I'll go on my left, close, step over, and touch. Alright. So, the two attacking moves that you can use today that we worked on, the double scissor, and the step over. So once again, go out, practice these moves on your own as many times as you like, as many times as you need. And remember, the more we practice, the better we get. See you in the next video. Thanks.